Aha. Complete address. I sent two. One made it through. One didn't. Appears to be as set. Not sure about this bottom tape. Uh, oh, yeah, that's my tape because I put two boxes together to make the right size box. So there is no additional tape on this box as, as far as I can tell. I'll get my knife down there. Okay, Alex, please enjoy these toys. Okay, and there's bubble wrap. Bubble, bubble, bubble wrap. What all is in here? Let's see. Oh, there they are down at the bottom. There are the five missing red line loose cars and the blister packs. The blister packs nicely wrapped, but wrapped individually. Let's see how they survived. I didn't put plastic blister pack protectors in there because that is bigger box, more, more poundage and very expensive postage. So here they are. Just regular blister packs, Jackrabbit Special, Whipped Creamer Green, beautiful, and a beautiful yellow, and a paddy wagon, and a beautiful red, and they all survived perfectly on their trip to Dubai and back. United Arab Emirates or something like that. All right, next, let's open some more boxes. Okay, look, at I got one, two, three, four, five, six boxes to open. Let's see what's in these boxes. Here's a small one. Now, somebody complained the other day about watching me open boxes, but you know, hey, that's how this all got started. I just wanted to do box opening videos like other guys on eBay that, or on YouTube do box opening videos. I thought it was pretty cool. And so I'm opening boxes and I, oh, look at that. It's a metal train freight car, BSNF, BNSF. Very nice. Metal power series. I've been collecting those for a while. You know what happens is you get something like that and then you find out that there's all these models and then you have to get every single one. So I'm working on it. I have almost every one already. Just keep getting them. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but they're so cool. I love them. I'm starting to fall in love with trains. Maybe that's just the thing that you do when you get a little bit older and you got some money and time to mess around a little bit here and there. Five trains, hey, what's in here? I think this might be another train for the train out loud. I know I've got some Redline blister packs in here somewhere. Nice bubble wrap, though. Hey, that's a lot of wrap. It is down the... Oh, it's one I didn't have. BNSF Caboose Green. Very beautiful. I think I had to pay a lot for that one. No, I think I've got one coming from Canada that's much more. That's what it is. Much more. Oh, don't see the address. Don't see the address. I'm going to turn up at my door. I don't even like that. Oh, look at that. Oh, here's another one. I know there's some hot ones in here somewhere, but we got some metal train, more metal train, metal train. I've got almost the whole series now, except for maybe the Alaska engine, Canadian National. Very cool. CNR, Canadian National. All right. There we go. Here we go. Another box. And my address is right out in the open there, isn't it? Damn it. I'll have to learn some technique. Get that out of there. Can't be putting my address on the internet for crying out loud. People will be coming by wanting to buy Hot Wheels. I don't want to sell them. I just do it once in a while. You know, for fun. All right. Oh, it is. It's a blister pack. What is it? What is it? It's a pig and a poke. It is a blue, a blue silhouette. Hey, hey. It's a blue silhouette. Mint condition, look at that. In the blister, a 70 blister. No cracks, pretty nice find. Look at that, look at that. All right, there's another one. Oh, this one's heavy. I think that's another train thing. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, I know what that is. It's another train thing. All right. All right, yes, yes, yes. Ah, uh, it's another blister pack! Blister pack! Yay! I love blister packs. I got 60 of them the other day. And now, oh, this one's got toilet paper. Hmm, I should save it. In case there's a run on it. Ew. Alright.
right, you definitely don't want toilet paper with a run on it. So let's take this off here. It's like a mummy. I'm ready for Halloween here as a mummy. Ooh, dear. This one's nasty, but this I bought for a ripper. Look at that beautiful ripper. Wow. Yeah, I was hoping it was really clean because the package looked terrible. So it looks like a nice ripper. Ripper dipper. Yay. Ripper. Ripper, ripper, ripper. All right. What's in here? Oh, this is a. Uh, this is probably the only piece of that model power, model train, metal train, model power that I wasn't that crazy about, but I bought one anyway, just so I say I had one. The white rock water. Oh, look at that! You put in a plastic bag. How nice is that? Sealed it up. Pretty cool. White water, white rock, Waukesha, Wisconsin. Yeah, look at that. So you got all these back here. Five cabooses, four reefers, five metal tanks, five, four metal boxes, quad hoppers. That Alaska, I just got one of those the other day at the train store. So the question might be, do you have a train? Well, I do. It goes around the floor of my toy room and through a tunnel over there, past the blister packs, stamp albums, and around there, around the corner, and there it is, past the big wooden box. And that's all. That's all I've got. It's pretty sad and pathetic, but it's something. So I have this controller here. Pretty cool. I saw this on SMT Mainline. Had to have one, too. Oh, there goes my train. There it goes. Oh, my gosh. There she rolls. A combination of metal train and some roundhouse models. Hey, why is that one taken apart? Oh, I bought a batch of trains from a guy. I just keep buying train stuff, you know. Collector stuff, you know how that goes. Here she comes again. One more time around for the train. Slow down, you're going too fast. All right, everybody, thanks for joining me on this video. A few features of my toy life. That's right. Lost Box, the big Lost Box from Dubai United Air Emirates and some recent purchases here and there and the train. Thanks for joining me everybody and please be sure to check out my other 475 videos. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.